Good evening, I'm Dave Savini in for Jim Williams. Developing tonight, a deadly double shooting at a Chicago gas station. Two men killed in the middle of the afternoon. CBS 2's Stephen Graves is live at the 7th District Police Station in West Inglewood. Stephen, the police station is less than a mile from the shooting. Dave, that's right. Only about a 10 minute walk. And if that doesn't strike you, what will is the aftermath. What we saw that shooting scene, at least a dozen bullet holes in one car. Screams from a loved one in anguish as she sees the evidence of this brutal double murder. We counted 14 bullet holes in this car at a West Inglewood gas station. Some in the frame, most bullets fired in the passenger side window. Police staying at 61st and Ashland until the vehicle was towed off from in front of a gas pump around 7. The shooting happening around 3 this afternoon. Getting called the shots fired. People are shooting. Chicago police say the two victims, a 20 year old man, another 33, were in the gas station lot when another dark colored vehicle pulled up. Workers at the nearby food mart say a gun was sticking out of that vehicle's window. Shot, one in the vehicle, one outside of the gas station, both critical condition. When officers arrived, that suspect vehicle gone. It looks like the shooter was a black Jeep Cherokee. Um, I stole it in northbound on Ashland. The 20 year old man was pronounced dead near the pump. The 33 year old man shot in the chest died at the University of Chicago Hospital. <laughs> Gas station workers say the whole shooting is caught on the many surveillance cameras on the property. And the manager says police have that video. He did not want to give it to us, but workers there say footage did pick up that suspect vehicle's plates. Police have not said if anyone is in custody. Reporting live here at the 7th District Police Station, Stephen Graves, CBS 2 News. Dave. Stephen, thank you.